Hello and welcome to the Caring Matters podcast. I'm Liz Tassone and I'm here today with a whole host of people who are going to explain to us about the Deaconess Medical Monitoring. And so first we're going to explain Holly Williamson is our uh, Deaconess Marketing Manager. So first she's going to explain the, the PERS and first explain what that is and what, what this is available and why we have this. Thank you, Liz. Like she said, I'm Holly Williamson. I'm the Marketing Manager for Deaconess Medical Monitoring here at Deaconess located on Straight Street in Clifton. Cincinnati, Ohio. Cincinnati, Ohio. That's correct. Our PERS unit, otherwise known as Personal Emergency Response System, can give clients comfort, keep, help keep them independent in their own home. They wear a necklace style pendant or a wrist style pendant of their choice, or they are welcome to choose both. If there is an emergency of any kind, not a fall only, any kind, someone is at the door at 10 o'clock at night, it is not me, for my mother, press your button, you live alone, press your button, that's an emergency, you're dizzy, you're nauseous, press your button. This is the regular purse, this, uh, and they take landlines, this too, the white one, is our most contemporary purse that's available currently and it too takes a landline. The difference between these two PERS units is the black one will talk in a robotic voice and say emergency calling several times and then a live operator will come on the two-way communication unit. This particular unit actually beeps very loud and then a live person comes on versus the robotic voice. The central station rep will stay on until help has arrived if you need the help. Maybe it's a non-emergency, you've lost your pendant, maybe it's unplugged. They will do a service work. There is no additional charge for service calls or extra pendants. While I'm on these particular two purge units, they run $35, that's a one-time installation fee, and it's $35 a month, and they both take landlines. It is a month-to-month -month lease. There are no long-term contracts. It can be placed on hold if a client goes to the hospital or has to rehab for some reason. They just give us a quick call, and we will do that in the system remotely. And you have uh, people like Chris coming to yes. install the unit. So. Mm -hmm. Chris Cassettis, he's one of our installers here at Deaconess Medical Monitoring. And he can talk a little bit about what that entails. Well, all, what I do is, I, like I said, I go to the house, I install it, make sure all the information is correct, and I install this one or this one right into your telephone line. And do you test the unit to make and sure I it's... I test it to make sure that it's uh, working properly. So the actual emergency people will come on, say, hey, do you need help? We say, no, we're just testing our button. Okay, very good. Very he good. also collects um, a lot of the upfront data. The emergency responders are extremely important. If there is no answer on these two-way units, our central station will hang up and call the home phone. If there's no answer there, they are mandated to send EMS right away. They are assuming that they're seized out, they might have had a stroke, they might have fell and hit their head, so they need to go ahead, get to the residence as quickly as possible. After they Central Station notifies EMS, then they will start notifying first responder, second responder, etc. Okay. I have a question about if you're wearing one of these and you go out to get the mail. Uh -huh and you hit the button, let's say you fall outdoors and mm -hmm. you hit the button. Is there a radius that this works within? There is. It's a 300 feet radius. So these are mainly for in the home and around the home. If they can't hear each other again, the client is outside checking the mail and has fallen. Of course, the unit is in a central location in their home they will automatically dispatch EMS. Okay. So if it's outdoors still going and it's to pressed, ping our right. central station. So if they don't get a response once this has been 
uh, pressed, mm -hmm. then they'll automatically send someone. Absolutely. Very good, very good. And you brought someone here that actually uses this. Uh, I did. Yeah. So, Bill, thank you for joining us. And tell us um, what this does for you in terms of, is it peace of mind? Why did you choose to use this? Well, first of all, my children were the ones that put me <laughs> up to this. And it is, when I'm not there, it's really uh, a godsend because it's, uh, you know, it, that's, if my wife falls when I'm not there and she can just push the button and everything's fine. Yeah. Emergency responders come. Right. Have, have you ever had to use it? Has she ever had yes. to? Okay. Yes, several times. Okay. But not lately. Good, <laughs> good. But it worked as, as needed. Yes. Perfect. So for you and for your children, and I think that's oftentimes what generates a call for one of these, is that the, the children of an older adult say, you know, this really bothers me that uh, you're home alone and um, what can we do? Because uh, in order to honor that you just want to stay in your own home. Cannot you? detect telephone line. It's, it's talking to us now. Explain what it just told us. Um, cannot detect telephone line. So the reason that this black unit is stating that to us is because this is for a cellular phone. A lot of individuals these days are going just with a cell phone and no landline. Uh, cheaper, less bills to pay, and then that is our cell phone unit, if that's what they have. And this is, I always say, uh, whose life have you saved lately? because it's a big deal and this is what this looks like so also stepping up to the fact that a lot of people aren't using landlines and so this is also available for folks you don't have to have just a, um, a landline to use that particular unit so it was telling Correct. us that it wasn't I mean this is a sample right. right so it wasn't hooked up and so it was letting us know that it had no way to communicate exactly which is also a good fail-safe Right. You know, if the, if the line goes out, then it's going to let you know that you're not protected at this moment. That's right. Essentially. All of these actually do okay. tattletale, and we do get activity reports on every client for every product, 365 days a year. So if Margaret Iannacci from Cincinnati, Ohio had fallen, I would see that in my activity report tomorrow. And okay. I would see what rep was on the line with her. Did they stay on that two-way communication device until help arrived? What was the solution? Okay, so Deaconess itself keeps track of, oh, yes. of how, how effective and um, how these are working. Yes, ma'am. Very good. So tell us once again, this is called a PERS. A PERS. And it stands for Personal Emergency Response System. Okay. It can be a pendant. It can be a wrist mm -hmm. um, to wear. And once you press that button, uh, things are going to happen. So, very good. Well, I, I love this because it just, uh, like you said, Bill, for your children and for you when you're away, it's that peace of mind that's so important to people uh, and just maintaining uh, independence and staying where you want to be. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, thank you very much. Not a problem. And we have our new Val Pack. Uh, ads out today too. Okay. So er, I'd like everyone to be looking for these. They're brand new, free installation. That's a $35 value. So it says on the coupon, peace of mind for a dollar a day. Which that's exactly which what is, it amounts to. Yeah, which is wonderful. So I'm Liz Tassone. I want to thank you for listening and I want to thank our group here for being with us today and explaining the Deaconess Medical Monitoring System. And uh, I'm Liz Tassone, and always remember that caring matters.